My wife is in love with another man. A man who has inspired her. A man who has helped her gain a new perspective. A man who has helped her embrace challenges. And a man who has actually helped her take action. That man's name is Alex Honnold. I get it. Alex Honnold, he's an amazing rock climber. Arguably the best rock climber in the world. But with his inspiring work comes great consequence. Great consequence for me, great consequence for our relationship, and the consequence of the fact that Whitney just wants to rock climb. So let that be a lesson for you kids out there. With great inspiration comes great consequence. So be aware of those who are inspired. So as a result, she asked me, her family, and some friends to go rock climbing. Thank you, Alex Honnold. Now just take like a five minute rest. <laughs> okay, it really wasn't that bad. And yes, there was a moment where I actually said the F-bomb out loud and Andres, the little nine year old, was asked me later when we were going back to the car, he was like, Johnny, did you did you say a naughty word? And I was like, no, I didn't say a naughty word. And he goes, yes, you did. You said F I heard you say And then he went and asked his parents, did Johnny say He said right. So it, 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 was a, it was a good, hilarious moment. Um, but yes, I, I did say that. So uh, sorry, world. Uh, you know, when you're in an extreme pressure of like trying to go through some rock that you don't know how to climb and it gets stressful and your arms give out, yeah, you're gonna say probably F But hey, if you are trying to rock climb for the very first time, or you're just new to rock climbing altogether or don't do it often, Suezca, Colombia is a great location because the geography provides a wide array of like rock climbing cliffs that are very suitable for beginners. So this was a great place to really get some of that actual exposure. And when you go and do it, you know, you have to pay for guides uh, and those guides really do help you out. So just some quick tips, like one, you know, you wanna follow the instructions. They're going to really guide you up those rock climbing cliffs. Uh, you wanna go in there with a good attitude, positive attitude and encourage each other. And then you just wanna really embrace the challenge. Like it's going to get tough in the tougher climbs. You know, they start with the easier climbs and then it gets a little progressively tough, more difficult. Um, and if you're already an experienced rock climber, you can go to the more ex experienced rock climbs if you want to. More than anything, you want to have fun while you do it. And I hope you guys enjoy our experience rock climbing in Suezca, Colombia. <laughs> I'm getting ready for this rock climbing. It's a beautiful day already. Just gorgeous out here. Apparently this whole area used to be a, a coral a coral reef years ago. Um, we're talking about like, you know, thousands, millions of years ago or so uh, when this whole area was underwater. Water. excited this has been one of my dreams this is our climbing or my climbing birthday a gift and I'm so so happy with you guys that's my mom Thank you. 
Okay, I made it. I'm all the way up here. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, it's so tiring. It's so different. Different type of challenge <sighs> to go up this. It makes me all shaky. I'm actually really shaky. Mi mamita Miko. Uy. rock. It's pretty tough. Sandrea. Oh. I'm tired. My knees already hurt. My hands hurt.
I did. There you guys have it. Thank you guys for watching this video. Whitney and I are really big on taking on challenges and trying things that are new that push you beyond your normal limits. This is for a variety of reasons because it's going to break up that mundane routine that we typically have in our lives. It's going to help us really formulate a new experience and have something to reflect back on. And it, all those things come with a byproduct called uh, dopamine production inside your brain, which some people attribute to being called happiness, right? But happiness is not the end result. It's just a byproduct of really just trying new things and experimenting with things that challenge you. So yes, Alex Honnold really did inspire us, both of us, not just Whitney, to Hey, you know, try out some rock climbing. This is like nothing compared with, 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 with what that man does. But with all that said, you know, go out there, make peace, find gratitude in all things, and always stop and smell the damn roses. Peace. <laughs>